So I've got a house I'm working on and I'm on the roof right now so sorry for the perspective if it's bad but um, in this house there is a chimney that goes uh, obviously through the roof through the floor and all the way down to the basement and it is uh, at one point it probably had some sort of wood and oil burning stoves and then uh, it is now attached to an uh, oil burning furnace that is uh, sort of a central heat in the basement and um, all that is being removed this house is being updated with a heat pump so um, I'm gonna take this chimney down because I'm gonna need to end up re-roofing it plus it cuts into the space that's in the laundry room of this house and it also causes roofing issues this is a uh, um, a rough house that I'm completely renovating and um, I thought this was sort of a cool step in tearing down this chimney I've never done it before but it's pretty basic you just tear it down so I'm gonna just take a sledgehammer and bust it up at the top and work my way down all the way to the basement but for uh, right now all I'm really trying to do is just make it through the roof and get out of the way to where I can reframe the joist that interferes with um, that the chimney interferes with to where I can go ahead and drive all the ceiling in the laundry room and kitchen so um, let's go ahead and get started All right, that was the first block and it seems like it's gonna go pretty smooth. All I gotta do is break them off, take them off one at a time. So as you can see, we're coming towards the end of the day. It's getting a little dark. Um, and the hole has been patched right through the center of that patch there. I replaced the, well actually, the ceiling joist came down, rafter came down and was split here to here and then came down the rest of the way to the eaves. So what I did is I took a 16 foot long uh, two by six and scabbed along the side, basically making a new rafter and then scabbed on some pieces on the side to be a little ledger for this um, patch. And this roof is going to eventually get completely re-roofed, but I bought a square of shingles three packs and I went ahead, um, I'm going to go ahead and just uh, lay them all in to the existing shingles just for a good temporary, semi-temporary, permanent repair, maybe a for a year or so before I end up re-roofing this house. But I um, just need to come in here now with the black paper tuck it up under a course of shingles and then I'll just weave in um, to the side. So I'm going to go ahead and get this all done before it gets dark on me. Just wanted to show you what it looked like after the chimney um, was removed. <laughs> 